because the people who work with me are very passionate about products, about cosmetics, about beauty, about skincare, but they are also young mothers with young children. Mm -hmm. So I said, uh, let's see whether we can build um, that sort of company. And with their engagement and their passion, and uh, let's build um, a range of products, build it up so people can see how they can use it in their everyday life. So I think I approached it more as not so much as a money-making venture, but as a way to educate people about good products. My philosophy is that um, good skincare does not have to be expensive skincare. Mm -hmm. And that's what I found with this particular brand, that it is effective, um, it is safe to use, and um, you have the halal certification, there's an added bonus, but uh, it is affordable and it works for many people, which is why we have fans all over the place. So Alhamdulillah, I think um, that was how I approached it. But I realized along the way that you have to have um, the trappings, so to say, that goes with HR, that goes with management, of course, mm -hmm. and uh, the financial aspect. So I manage the business um, slowly and surely based on like a woman manages um, a household. You must be prudent, you must, but you must take care of uh, the development of your product, in this case also of your team, and uh, you must manage your resources wisely. So maybe it was a simplistic and naive view, but so far so good. Our growth has been quite steady, Alhamdulillah. And um, I like to, uh, to think that we are growing well into this next stage. Mm. Well, early on you mentioned to me um, that your brand and your business started in 2001. When you actually made the decision to, jo to actually start this company, what made you decide to go into the cosmetic industry, which is very challenging and competitive as it is, compared to other industries? I think it was the brand. Um, the company was started in 2001 um, it, by a group of um, industry experts who had this whole line of products that they wanted to bring in that was plant-based and uh, organic uh, in nature. So they felt that and it has to be good skincare at an affordable price. So when I was looking for skincare for my children and for myself, and then this was the brand that I found. And because it was so difficult to get, I decided to see whether I did my research, due diligence, and found that it was actually uh, looking for a buyer. Mm -hmm. So, uh, as well as someone to manage it. Uh, so I thought that, well, let's see. And the whole idea of even moving through uh, something like from uh, from a business background with HR and a HR background in training into um, a business background, you have to have the people who know the industry.